Hey everyone, it's Sharon and welcome back to Beauty and Beyond. Hey friends, so today I decided that I wanted to share to you what I do to my face whenever I am sick and still I need to go out and look presentable and alive, not a zombie. Today, I will be going out to pay some bills and do some errands and of course, I don't want to look like a zombie outside. And yeah, actually today I'm feeling really really still bad. <coughs> my throat still hurts and I still have some irritation on my sinus. It wasn't a good day today actually, but I still wanted to share to you what I do whenever those days come because you know you can prevent it from happening and if you're a parent you need to do some stuff even you are still sick so that's it and although it's not necessary for you to apply makeup when when you are sick but if you're going out that's a time when you need it so that's why I'm doing it right now when actually I I don't really feel like doing my makeup my hands I know it feels so heavy and it it takes so much effort right now for me for me on a regular day makeup is something that is so um, relaxing to me I can put on makeup easily like that but today is not the day but I don't have any <laughs> I don't have any option because I really need to go out and at least look presentable outside so yeah I think that's it and let me show you what I do a very very quick um, makeup look just to you know look alive and not a zombie so if you want to know what I do on my sick days and doing makeup then just keep on watching Excuse me for my very sad voice today. I'm not so lively since I really don't have the energy right now. And yeah, I'm so sorry that this video is kind of on a lit on the, you know, not on the hyper side of me. I hope you understand. So let's get on with this look or this video. <laughs> so whenever I am sick, I always make sure that I apply a lip balm onto my lips because I hate that feeling when my lips are dry and cracking so most of the time if I am sick I tend to have dry lips so I'm gonna be applying lip balm all over so I'm just going to apply my moisturizer together with this foundation and this is my current favorite foundation it's from Maybelline. It's their Super Mineral 24. And I don't know if this is available here in the Philippines, but this I got this one from Japan. Like that. And then I'm just gonna blend using my fingers. I just wanted something very quick, you guys. That's why I applied my moisturizer and foundation together. I don't need a very, very um, full coverage. I just wanted to even out my skin, at least because right now my skin is so red and irritated so I just wanted something that would even out the skin but not too much because my nose is really really irritated then I will be taking my um, concealer pro concealer by Mac and I will be applying a tiny bit onto my under eye area this is too much this is too much so I'll just use my fingers to blend that then I will just take my real technique sponge and blend this further here so 
so now I'm gonna be setting my face using my Johnson's baby powder I love this one to set my face especially if I have some irritation to my nose because I cannot cannot tolerate any fragrance if my nose are irritated so my nose is so irritated right now so this is the only <laughs> one that is acceptable right now so I'm gonna set my face using this one guys up to the neck slap that <laughs> okay so i think we're done and i'm just going to do my brows using this eyebrow pencil from daiso this is my favorite one brows is so important to me guys i cannot leave the house without my brows this is so important <laughs> Oh, by the way, I have a video on how I groom and fill in my brows. If you're interested, I will have that link always on the description box, guys. So now I'll be applying an eyebrow mascara. This is from Zizan. It's my favorite one. This just makes the brow hairs stay intact entire day guys if i wanted them to you know stay put like this like brushing upwards definitely it will make them stay that way for the rest of the day that's why i like this one aside from having a tint on them so yeah just a quick eyebrow and then we're done so next, I will be contouring my nose using my Duo Powder from Daiso. This is my favorite one, guys. And I just love this one because it has a more cooler undertone. Such a perfect, perfect, such a perfect nose contour. Yeah, not too much. Yeah, not too much. And I'm going to use this to, to uh, um, give... Um, a little definition in my eyelids yeah not too much just like that and then I will be con then I will be contouring my face a little bit using this NYC bronzer yes just a teeny bit because I don't want to spend too much time <laughs> Then for my cheeks, I will be using this um, blush from Daiso 2. This is my favorite one as of the moment, guys. Just a teeny blush so that we will look at least alive, not a zombie. Oh, today is Monday and it's Walking Dead Day. I'm so excited to see the next episode. The last episode one was such a heartbreak for me. Glenn, goodbye Glenn. <laughs> oh gosh. So that's for the blush. I think we're done with the blush and then... Um, the eyes, you may be surprised what will I do to the eyes, but I will be applying a false eyelashes onto my eyes because that's the most important thing for me because I look so sad and zombie-ish if my eyes are so sad too. So I, I don't want to apply any mascara and eyeliner, so I'm just going to curl my lash. not too much because it feels so irritated right now so i already applied my false eyelashes guys as you can see and you may be wondering and a little confused um 
I am not well and I'm sick and all but still I find time and effort to apply some false eyelashes the reason is that um, aside from I don't like the fact that I will be applying um, eyeliner into my eyes I really hate that right now and also I don't like applying mascara into my lashes because I don't want to go through um, removing it later at night I I don't have the energy for that so for me um, false eyelashes is so 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 easy to apply and it just makes wonders you guys it just makes me look so alive and not a zombie as you can see right now I feel and I look so different um, compared to the beginning of this video so yeah false lashes is my go-to whenever I am sick and it's very very easy really to apply false lashes if you keep on practicing and the one that I'm using right now by the way is this one from Taiwan lashes and it's the number Y66 in case if you are interested to know so the last thing that I need to do is my lips so I'm just going to remove some of the um, of the balm that I applied earlier and for my lips the one that I'll be using today is this one from Revlon it's the Revlon color balm stain <laughs> I forgot the exact name but I have the shade number 65 oh my gosh can you see that my hands are shaking <laughs> so this is what I will be applying today because this has a very very moisturizing feeling and yeah i just wanted something moisturizing right now on my lips since i feel so dry and choppy and this one is really really very moisturizing you guys i highly recommend the revlon balm stains because yeah it's really moisturizing and this color is so perfect for me right now so we're done and i feel like i look a little um not so sickly right now compared to the beginning of this video that i look so gross and so sick and like a zombie so i'm pretty much happy <laughs> yeah and oh my gosh i'm shaking <laughs> i'm already shaking right now so i this is what i do whenever i am sick and i still need to get out and look a little presentable so it's very quick and easy i only slap some few products on my face just one two three and go so yes i feel so 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 alive now guys <laughs> actually so i hope you find this video helpful and if you do please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also if you're new to my channel make sure to subscribe so that you can see more of me on my later videos and yeah thank you so much for watching and always remember that makeup is not a mask worn to hide oneself but rather it makes you a better you so i hope to see you on my next video guys and i love you always peace